Hey everybody, thank you so much for tuning in. Today we're going to be doing Valentine's theme nails. So I usually start with my EC Basket Coffin Nails. This week I ordered stiletto nails from the same brand. They're much shorter. The shape is so different. I'm not sure how I feel about them yet. But they're only $7.99, so it's worth buying them so you don't have to hassle with reshaping. So right now I'm just trying to reshape it so it looks a little better. And I'm also trying to make sure that it fits my cuticle better. The other kind fits so much nicer. So this one I have to work a little bit more. So every time I do anything to the nail, I have to keep trying it on to my finger to make sure that I'm not taking too much off. So now I'm going to use this little makeshift stand. And I've labeled all of them so that I don't confuse the nails. And with some Dollar Tree poster tack, I'm just going to attach all of my nails that have been sized out. These are the gel polishes I'm using. I wanted to give them a try. I see these online all the time and I know a lot of you are on a budget. These come six colors for $20. And I'm gonna be painting three nails. What I will tell you this is that the consistency is different for every color. So some of them are really good and some of them not so great. I didn't love the quality of the white polish. For these two accent nails, I'm just going to use this glitter from Dollar Tree. Normally I would sponge this on, but because the nail polish was still tacky, I decided to see if it would help the glitter hold in place, and it absolutely did. For the next nail, I'm gonna use my Crystal Katana and this glitter from Dollar Tree. And what I'm gonna do is add a gel top coat, and then I'm gonna start placing my little pieces of glitter in the shape of a heart. The reason I use gel top coat is because you can move it around until you cure it and it just makes it a lot easier to get the shape that you want. So this is what it should look like, just top coat it and cure it. For the next one I'm using my Deco Color Paint Pen. I love this thing and use it for everything. And on a clear nail I'm just going to paint on a heart. So now that I have my heart shape, I'm going to go in with some brush on gel. This stuff is nice and thick. You can just use regular top coat, but I had it on hand. And this is so it can hold my little rhinestones in place. If you know exactly where you want them, you can also use little dabs of glue every time you place a rhinestone. So now I'm going to grab these little rhinestones and my crystal katana once again, and I'm going to start positioning these around the heart. Again, you can reposition as much as you want, use whatever tip you'd like. This thing is so convenient. So this is what it should look like. Make sure that you cure it, and with an alcohol swab, take off that sticky layer. Make sure that whenever you're using something like rhinestones or crystals, that you're not adding top coat on top of them so they don't lose their shine. For my last nail, I'll be using these nail art stickers. And what you're gonna do is peel them off and place them directly onto the nail. Once you have them in the position that you like, you can grab any top coat. I'm gonna use my gel top coat and I'm gonna top coat all of my nails, cure them, wipe them down, and bam, you have a beautiful set of Valentine's theme nails. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Please let me know in the comment section what kind of nail looks you'd wanna see and thank you so, so much for watching. Till next time.